declaration known to everyone, to your family, to your friends, and to your church family. Girls, the white flower that you are holding, and guys, the white flower that you are wearing represents purity. It stands for virtue and innocence. Let that flower remind you that you are promising before everyone and before God that you will live a wholesome life, living for him in all areas. At this time, we will take a vow of purity. Acknowledging that God has made you in his image, made your body to be his temple, and has saved you by his grace, removing all of your sin, do you vow to please him from this day forward, to be obedient to his word, and to remain pure in your speech? in your thoughts and in your and in your actions do you vow to wait for your future spouse whom god has created especially for you and honor god in your relationship and one day marriage do you vow to let your life be a pure reflection of his goodness grace and mercy and be an example to all believers as stated in first timothy 4 12 if so please respond by saying i do Ay, qué lindo. At this time, parents, you can go ahead and present the, your, um, your child, your student, with their purity ring. Oh, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Father. Thank you, and Father. As they're receiving their ring, uh, oh, we're really all, all involved in a part of this oh. ceremony as well, because what we're going to do right now is we're going to pray for them. Yeah. And how many people know that this is not just something that one person does, but this is something that a whole church, we rally around them and we say, you know, we support you in that. We're excited for you and making that decision. We're going to do what we can to encourage you and to stand with you in that. So I'm going to ask, uh, invite Jordan and Megan Romero. They're going to come and they're going to pray over our students, the ministers uh, in training here at Calvary. And I would invite you just to stand with us uh, as we reach out our hands and as we pray for our students this morning. And then Pastor Swell, if you can just step up and just uh, lay, lay your hands on them as we pray. Why don't you just stretch out a hand. God, we thank you, God, for, for these students' lives. God, we, we pray, God, and today we lift them up, God. We commit them to, to you, Jesus. And God, we thank you, God, for them just taking this small um, this small token, God, just for just for committing to, to, to just live from the inside out, Jesus. God, we pray that you would direct their path, God. I pray that they would be empowered by your grace, God. And I pray, God, that they would walk, God, in the direction that you have called Jesus. them to walk, God. I pray, God, that they would just influence others, God, in their righteousness, God, in the way that they walk, God. And God, I pray again, that they would just continue to follow you, God, continue to just strive after you, God. And I pray for perseverance in their life, God. I pray, God, that you would strengthen them, God. I pray, God, that they would just, um, just wholeheartedly, God, commit to you, God. I pray, God, that they would just, um, just be with you, God, and and and, and live. For you, God, with all their mind, God, all their soul, all of their body, God, and all of their strength, God, in every area of their life, God, we commit, God, for purity, God, we commit, God, that they would be set apart for you, God, and God, we thank you, God, that they would just take this step of faith, God, and I pray, God, that they would always know that you are there for them, God, that you are there every step of the way, God, we pray for their spiritual life, God, I pray, God, that they would draw close to you, God, and as they draw close to you, God, that you would give them, God, the abundance. God, out of your abundance, God, what they have in their hearts, God, the desires in their hearts, Jesus, and God, we pray for each and every one of them, God, we pray for safety over their lives, God, and we pray that they would just be overwhelmingly blessed, God, as they as they live their lives, we pray all these things in Jesus' name, amen. Come on, let's just to our young people this morning. Jesus, to come in a glory. Jesus, hallelujah. This is the example. This is what we want to show the world. Amen. Amen. We want to influence Amen. them in this way, not allow them to influence us in our way. Students, we are proud of you. We yeah. stand with you. We are for you. And uh, we, I want to let you know that this church loves you and supports yeah. you. Hallelujah. That's, that's Thank you, Jesus. We love you guys. Thank you.